Princess Plug helps out. I think we got more jelly on our faces than our toast. Me? Clean face me. Ta-da! Flugtastic! I wish I could wash away the sticky jelly with bubbles. I know! Ta-da! <laughs> Kinda works. Nope, gotta wash my face. Race you to the sink! <laughs> Abby! Dad? Teeny Terry? What happened? We were trying to build a knick-knack shelf, but we messed it up. And now if either of us moves... The whole thing will fall apart. Oh, knick-knack shelf not stick together, knick-knack shelf. You're right, but you can make it stick with your glitter glue. Me glitter glue me. On three, you move out and Princess Flood glues. One, two, three! Whoa! Yay! Spectacular! Great job, Princess Flug! Yay! You saved the day! Thanks for helping, Princess Flug. You're the best. Cousin Flotilda! Fuzzly cousin? Yep, and her friends are my friends. Hi, your friend. <laughs> Aww. <gasps> Look, tea party, Flugtilda. Tea party. First, mini big entrance. Huh? <laughs> Everyone sing with me. Flugtilda, me. Yeah, us conga, us sing. Us conga, us sing. No friends, me. No new home, me. <laughs> 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 Rosapalooza, you say? Oh, we have roses. There's one right here. Beautiful. Smell. <laughs> oh. Abby, glitter goo. Oh, I'm sure it's nothing to worry about, Judge Thorne. Uh, why don't you come in for some tea? <sighs> A cup of tea would be nice, as would a napkin. Thank you. Psst. Let me know if you find the roses. Okay, Bosley, we know there's a Fuzzly around here somewhere. Oh. But where? Ah. Huh? Oh! Look! A glitter glue trail! Let's follow it! Me, Princess Flug, me! Hello, Princess Flug. So, you took all those roses to help the hotel win the Rosa Palooza contest? Yes! Us win! Us! That's blizzacular! But you still shouldn't have taken things without asking. Me, sorry, me. Let the Rosa Palooza commence! <gasps> Contest starting, Abby. <laughs> oh, no! Wait! <laughs> Ta-da! 
Coach Thorn. This is our hotel's entry. Everyone helped. <gasps> Why, that's beautiful. By the flower power vested in me, I declare this hotel the winner of the Rosa Palooza contest. New elevator operator. Here you go. How to sad. Want to play with Pillbug? Sure. Ouchie, her tentacles mean Otis can't do anything. What if Otis uses your extendo hand to grab the Pillbug? Yeah! Extendo hand! Ooh. It works! Doesn't hurt! Now Otis can cuddle Pillbug! Aha! The elevator's free. Here, you help me with these. Princess Bug, I need a big favor. Can you run the elevator for a while? It's easy. Just make sure you're the only one who touches the buttons. Happy to help, Abby. Thanks so much. <laughs> Welcome to elevator. Oh, buttons. Stop! Abby said only me press buttons, me. <laughs> oh. Spring shoes, activate! 
Bars made a tower fort. Walls in here so shiny and sparkly. It's your fault, this. You should have built what I wanted. Places to make pretty things. Why couldn't you build what I wanted? Places to run around and climb. Now Abby and Bosley are trapped. Not trapped anymore. Yay! You have to come see this place. It's fantastic. Come on. Yeah! yeah. Pretty. So pretty! And look at all the places to climb around! Princess Flug's lumpy blanket. Time for your royal bedtime routine. <sighs> me getting sleepy, me. Then we'll start right away. First, you can sleep in my bed. Ooh. And finally, the cushiony, soft, extra thick royal polka dot blankie. Blankie is so soft and cushy, perfect for all sleepers. And its big round polka dots look like squeaky peepers. <laughs> You're right. The polka dots do look like squeaky peepers. Right this way, Your Highness. This blanket's so cozy and we're sleepy heads. We can stay awake, so we'll curl into bed. There, the perfect bed for a perfect night's sleep. Ah, bed's so nice, bed. Me sleep me. Bed feels lumpy, bed. So lumpy. Wait a minute. These polka dots look a lot like the peepers. I wonder. Zoom review specs activate. <laughs> All the lumps in Princess Flug's bed were the peepers hiding in the polka dots. <laughs> the peepers were sleepy, and they like sleeping on your royal blanket. Oh, me understand me, but me need blankie to sleep me. <sighs> it's okay, peepers. You don't need to use Princess Flug's blankie. I'll make you your own. Eight little blankies for eight little peepers. Night, night. <sighs> night, night. <Aww>. Fun <laughs> in the park. Rain, stop, Daddy. Play outside. <laughs> That's a splizacular idea, Bosley. Yeah. <laughs> Princess me, me need to stay. Why? Dirty park, dirty. Me clean, princess me. See? <laughs> if you don't want to go, you don't have to. But if you change your mind, you can come find us, okay? Come on, everybody. To the park! To the park! Abby and Bosley stay and play? We're playing in the park, but you should come. Me princess. No get dirty, no. What if Bosley and I keep you clean? Then will you come to the park? Me stay clean me? <laughs> you stay clean you. Then me park me. <laughs> <laughs> So she'll watch from her royal viewing box. Da -da 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 -da. A royal gold cushion! <gasps> and royal red carpet! Princess Flug, she'll have no mess. Play in the park, a clean success! Yeah. Yeah. The surprise birthday party! Mo 
party princess vlog, but you're invited too. Thanks, everybody. Have you seen your cake? Look at all the animals. No, no, you flower cake you. Flowers are okay, but I like the cheetah cake. Cake is for after the piñata. Who wants to play? Piñata. <laughs> <laughs> Me turn jungle cake into flower cake. <gasps> What happened? Where are the animals? I don't understand what happened, Abby. I can fix this, Mrs. Melvin. I just have to talk to Princess Flug. Princess Flug, we know you're in there. You didn't mean to make Melvin's party a mess, did you? Me, accident me. Don't be sad. Come on, we can make this better. Princess Flug has something to tell you, Melvin. Go ahead. Me, sorry, me. It's okay. It was a really cool party. You love parties, right? Me parties, me. And you want Melvin to have a great party, right? Melvin, great party. Melvin. So what if you turn this into the best Melvin birthday party ever? Me? Throw party me? Would you really do that, Princess Flug? Me? Yes, me!
Santa's flug stopped here. But why? Hmm. Abby, look! Another flower! Rain spark! If we want to get her home, we need a trail of flowers. when no one catches me. All oh, those somersaults and jumps and slides, that's gymnastics. And you're really, really good at it. You mean, <gasps> it's my talent? Ugh. Yes, your talent. The Hotel Talent Show presents Teeny Terry! <laughs> <laughs> I got stuck. All I wanted was a cozy little snug of my own, like Princess Flog and Otis. A teeny Terry snug is a great idea, but you should have it on the roof deck where you bird watch. I'd love a snug on the roof deck. Operation Build a Snug is on. To the roof deck! Teeny Terry, welcome to your new snug. Ooh. Snug. 
Agree. Uh, hmm, which button should I press? for Princess Flug. Step inside your dream snug. <laughs> what's wrong? The snugs are what's wrong. They're nothing like what I wanted. You're right. I'm so sorry, Teeny Terry. <laughs> <laughs> the snugs were all wrong. Uh, maybe I don't need a snug after all. Yes, you do. Just tell us exactly what you want. Okay, well, I want this. And definitely this. It's spectacular. Let's build. <laughs> what do you think, Timmy <laughs> Terry? Is it you? Yes, yes. This snug is all me. <laughs> Teeny Terry, our official to-do list. Ready. <clears throat> Fix Miranda's watering can. Add stuffing and repatch the cushion on the lobby couch. And last but not least, paint Abby's bedroom. <laughs> we have a long list of fixing to do. You said it, Teeny Terry. That's why I've got a surprise for you. A new screwdriver for your fix-it helmet! Teeny-tastic! Cool! <laughs> Thanks, Lex! Let's put your newest tool to use on to-do list item number one, the watering can. Tool time, Teeny Terry! <laughs> uh. All done! Here you go! Before we move on with the to-do list, I've got to get a new roller brush to do Abby's room. <laughs> but it's nothing a quick trip to the hardware store can't fix. Back in a jiffy, Teeny Terry. See ya! Hey, want to check out these colors in my room? I've got to get to work. Lex gave me a gift. Now I want to give him one, too. There, the stuffing's all back in the cushion. This will be so much quicker. Done. Teeny tastic. I sure hope Lex likes what we did. He'll love it. <laughs> <gasps> okay, Teeny Terry, I'm back. Surprise! <laughs> the cushion. It's fixed. There's more. Follow me. Incredible. You finished the to-do list. What an amazing surprise. It was a gift and I never would have gotten it done without the help of all my friends. Otis! Elevator shake and buttons pop off! Lex to the rescue! I see the problem. The little wheel's out of place and now the gears won't work. You'd have to be really small to get into a place that tight. Then it's a good thing you have your super small sidekick, Teeny Terry. Me? Yes! That's a great idea! What if I mess up? You can do this, Teeny Terry. I know you can. Okay, I'm going in. Yeah! I can do this. <gasps> I see it. Fantastic! Can you get it back in place? I think so. Get big inside the elevator panel, he'll break the whole thing. He can't help it. Every time he tries to fix something, he gets so frustrated. Hmm. Brain spark! That's his problem. He gets frustrated. Teeny Terry, I know what you need. Just count to five, nice and slow, and far away your troubles will go. Ready? I guess. One, two, Phew! It worked! And I'm gonna fix this elevator! 
wait to play with the pelican. Hi. I mean, uh, ah. is that your mom? Ah. Oh, no. She thinks I'm a baby pelican.
chipmunk friends. Mmm, Bosley delicious. Great idea, Abby. Go get him, Bosley. Okay. Yoo-hoo, chipmunks. Nice juicy acorn here. Nice smooth shell. Jaunty acorn cap. And inside, uh, oh, which can't get me. to have my snug back. Thanks, Abby. I'm glad you're happy, Teeny Terry. Well, I'm ready for you to work your magic, Mrs. Melvin. How do you do it? I'll let you in on a little secret. This hairbrush. <gasps> hairbrush. <laughs> I can't wait to try this brush. A little spritz. Now I just need my... It's gone! There's trouble in the salon. We heard there's trouble. Whoa! Wow! I know. I just can't make the styles I want without my special brush. That must be why the fuzzly alarm went off. Zoom review specs activate! A clue. Hmm. A pink and yellow hair. <gasps> A new fuzzly! Mrs. Melvin, maybe that's who took your brush. Please find it so I can fix these hair catastrophes. Please tell me you found her brush. We haven't found it yet, but we know how to get it back. We'll get the Fuzzly to come to the salon. Yeah! We'll give her what she loves most. Someone who needs a great hairdo. I volunteer. If we can just talk to the Fuzzly, I know we'll get your brush back. Okay, Mom. Oh, my. I am so sad that I need my hair done. Oh, no! I'm coming! Just a sec. Won't be a moment. Phew! Sorry for the wait. You do need a new hairdo. Ugh! Voila! You're really good at hair. But why did you take Mrs. Melvin's brush? I wanted to be a great hairstylist like Mrs. Melvin. I shouldn't have taken it without asking, though. Can you forgive me? Aww. Aww. Closing the salon, but... Only for the day, Harriet. <laughs> what will I do if I can't style hair? Oh, just relax and have fun. But I relax and have fun styling hair. I love everything in the salon. Curling irons and... <gasps> Scissors! <laughs> <gasps> hair flare! What are you doing? I'm styling. Look! Cool! They are cool, but I was writing all my lists on those papers. I'm sorry. It's okay. Why aren't you in the salon? I want to be, but it's close today. I don't know what to do if I can't style. Hmm. Here, try these. Harriet size pruning shears. They are perfect. Hair flare! Ah! Ta-da! Wow! Amazing! I'm always happy when my styling hero, Mrs. Melvin, is around. Oh, that is so sweet. And I am gorgeous. <laughs> Yay, Harriet! What a wonderful way to use your talents. Thanks, Mrs. Melvin. But my favorite thing is styling hair and our salon. I'm glad to hear that, but the salon won't be open again until tomorrow morning, so you can enjoy the rest of your day off. But what would I do with myself? <gasps> I know! Oh, this is the best idea ever. Who knew relaxing could be fun? <laughs> Are you all going to watch me learn to dance? Nope, the peepers can't see you. They're wearing salon masks. Can't see, can't see, can't see, because we're wearing masks. I'll see you, but I'm the only one. You won't be scared around me, right? Right. Okay, peepers, hit the disco music. Go, Harry, go. Swing that disco on. 
Here we go. And a one. And a two. And a three. One, two, three. You're getting the moves. And you look fantastic. I'm starting to feel great. I love your hair. But if you want to try something new, I could work some magic. Huh? Oh, this swing! Yeah! <laughs> yeah. Harriet? <gasps> you saw me? I'm so embarrassed. I gotta go. <gasps> this is terrible. I'm never going to dance again. But Harriet, you love dancing. We gotta find a way to help her, Bosley. It's not much now, but with some colored lights, It'll be the most dance-tacular disco ever! Are you okay? I made it! 
Largefoot, this is Otis, Teeny Terry, Mo, Bo, Princess Plug, Harriet, and Curly. Everyone, this is our brand new fuzzly friend, Largefoot. Hi! Grumbles, you're really shedding. I think it might be time for a haircut. Haircut! <gasps> huh? I get the feeling you don't want your haircut. And we can make it fun. Fun how? We'll play follow the leader to the salon. <laughs> Grumbles love follow the leader. Then follow me. <laughs> Yahoo! <laughs> Brainsburg! Waipo loves Fuzzly Adventures! 
White Pole can use the gear and save us. Abby, Abby, are you okay? I need your help. All of our gear is with you, so I need you to put it on and rescue us. Can you do that? On it. Now, how do I? <gasps> I do, Pape Abby. Press the orange button. Orange button. <laughs> what do I do now? Say Bomber Blimp Jacket, activate. Bomber Blimp Jacket, activate. <laughs> <laughs> this is wonderful. Come on, Bosley. Jump. <laughs> <laughs> that was amazing. You were amazing. Super amazing. You're a real Buzzly catcher, right, Poe? Just like me. That, Babe Abby, is the greatest compliment you could ever give me. Chef Jeff's tuba. <laughs> 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 After just a little more practice, I didn't think anyone else was here. See, Princess Plug? Chef Jeff didn't mean to wake you. It was an accident. Please unstick his tuba. Me? Sorry, me. Oh, thank you. Ah! Too loud! Chef Jeff, it's so late. Everyone needs to sleep, and it's so noisy. What do we do? Chef Jeff? A bad note. Now I need to practice more. <gasps> I know you want to practice, but what if you could do it without making any noise? Then I could practice all night. My performance would be perfect. But how? Bosley, what do you have that can muffle the tuba and make it quiet? Hmm. Oh, ah, basketballs! Flizzacular! Pass it here, Bosley. My left! Score! Try playing now, Chef Jeff. Perfection! Thank you, Abby. Now, I'd better get back to practicing. Now we can all go back to bed. Abby meets Mo and Bo. Go, Mo, go! <gasps> cool! Let's see how fast we can fill up these boxes with stuff for our fort. Ooh, yeah, okay. Whoa, a lampshade. Bosley can always use a new hat. Huh? <gasps> I think the boxes are full, Bosley. Up. Uh. To the fort! More fort stuff. Let's go get the other boxes, Bosley. <laughs> no, no. Don't bounce on Bo. Time for Bo to go! Bo? Where Bo go? The Fuzzly Spotter! There's trouble at our play fort. <gasps> Hi, friend. I'm Abby. Want some Fuzzly treats? Wow, look at what you can do. That's spectacular. Help Mo find Bo? Mo find Bo? Twin Bo. I don't get it. You have a twin Fuzzly and you want to find him. Zoomer view specs, activate. Fuzzly tracks. They go right to the salon. <gasps> Mrs. Melvin, have you seen a Fuzzly that looks like her? Sorry, Abby, I haven't. You're all done. See you next time. We'll find him. The bike! Ma'am, excuse me. Oh! Mo? <laughs> Mo! I got this, Mo. Oh! Mo! Pogo Spring Shoes, activate! Woohoo! Caught ya, Bo. Chef Jeff and Curly. Hi, Chef Jeff. 
so sorry. No time for hellos. I've got a dinner party to prepare. I still have to mash the potatoes and frost the cake. Ugh, I'll never have enough time. Oh, early help. Early math. <laughs> <laughs> Be distracted by flying potatoes. Curly, please go with Abby and Bosley. Can Curly go? Yeah, it'll be fun. Come on, Curly. Okay. Uh... Chef Jeff's can't resist cake. Put sprinkles somewhere else. No, sprinkles stay. <laughs> sprinkles hug too. Ugh. Ugh. <coughs> if we made sprinkles smell beautiful, could she stay? If she smelled beautiful, of course. How sprinkles smell beautiful, Abby? I don't know, but I do know we have two experts on what's beautiful right here in this hotel. Come on, Bosley and Curly, to the salon. We are experts in all things beautiful. Like perfume. Watch. Uh-oh. Uh Sprinkles no good? She just kind of still smells like feet. Hmm. When my socks are dirty, my mom washes them and makes them smell great. I bet that'll really get rid of the smell. To the bath. Okie dokie, Curly. Bath time for sprinkles. Sprinkles! Flash!
no food. But the guests are really hungry. Hmm. I know. We'll make dinner ourselves. Really? Us? Yeah. How hard can it be? The rice is steaming. Curly's got the veggies. Let's tell everyone dinner's almost ready. Yeah, 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 yeah! Ladies and gentlemen, dinner is... The Fuzzly Spotter. Uh-oh. Curly's in trouble in the kitchen. <gasps> the dinner!
Puzzly Spotter. Ow! Spotted. Mo and Bo are in trouble on the hill. Ah! We're both stuck here way up high. Get us down, please, or we'll cry. On it. Bomber Blimp Jacket, activate. Mo and Bo and the video game. Oh, yeah. Go, Lex. Woo you're perfect. <gasps> Is that some kind of video game? Oh, this? Yeah, it's a snakes and ladders game. You want to play? We can't all use tablet. So what we play now, Abby? Let's play dress up in my room. No dress up for us. We'd rather stay. Are you sure you don't want to come and play with us? <laughs> <laughs> no, no turn. <laughs> 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 Now we can finish our chores. 
What's a chore? Tell us more. Chores are jobs around the hotel. We need everyone's help to make the hotel nice. Bosley and I make my bed and clean my room. My dad and Teeny Terry fix things. <laughs> Curly and Chef Jeff cook. <laughs> and Princess Flug takes care of the garden with my mom. <laughs> we want jobs too! We do, we do! Let me help you with your luggage. <laughs> wow, thanks, Mo and Bo. I can't believe you can carry all those bags. Hmm, carry bags. Rainbark! They'd be spectacular bellhops. Bells? That's all? Jingle, 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 jingle! <laughs> Bellhops carry luggage to and from rooms. That's the perfect job for Mo and Bo. We'll take your bags and away we go. Hello. Welcome to the Hatcher Palace Hotel. Don't worry about your bags. Our Bellhops will take them right up for you. We'll take your bags up on our backs. So you'll be free to just relax. Tap dancing fuzzly bellhops. <laughs> no wonder people love this hotel. Mo and Bo enter an art show. Oh my! Hi, Judge Thorne. Miss Hatcher, assorted fuzzlies. We think those boots are really neat. We want to put them on our feet. Ah uh, ah uh, ah! Uh. Those boots are the prize for my art in the park show. We can do a painting too. Will we get the cowboy boots if we do? If you win, then yes! Hooray! If we don't win those boots, we'll cry. Abby, can you help us try? Better believe I will. Ready, set, paint! <laughs> <laughs> I think you're swinging too fast. If you're not careful, you'll... <laughs> Bad. You really had a shot at winning those boots. What now, Abby? I'm not sure. Rainbow! I know how you can turn these ruined paintings into something spectacular. Hmm. Ruined artwork turned into something brand new. Mo and Bo, I declare you the winners. Yeah! Yeah! I'm making the prize two pairs of cowboy boots. Yeah! yeah. Yes! Woohoo! Mo and Bo's road trip. Ooh! What are you looking at, Mom? It's an exhibit a few towns over. A display of the world's largest tap shoes. Ooh! World's largest tap shoes on display? Please, let's go see them right away. That's a spectacular idea. We'll take you there to dance in front of the world's largest tap shoes. Ooh, I'm happy to drive you, but we'd better hurry. Today's the last day it's gonna be there, and it closes at sunset. Yay! Yay! We'll get to the world's largest tap shoes in plenty of time for you to dance in front of them. Right, Dad? Uh-oh, hold on, everybody. Why did we stop? Construction. Hi. How long do you think we'll be stopped? It'll be a while. I'm sorry, Mo and Bo. I don't think I can get you there in time. I'll have to fly you there myself. Come on, Mo and Bo. Whoa. This way. Just before sunset. 
I'm glad I didn't miss the show. Yeah. You made it. Tell you what, how about you join Mo and Bo, and I'll take the video. Spectacular. Planting, but me left watering can in basement me to the basement. 
basement. Woohoo! Roller skating? That looks fun. No, Bo, no! Follow the leader. That's the one. But I don't want to play that now. I want to roller skate. But following Bo is really great. Stop, Bo. I'm not playing. Bo just wants to get away. Mom could play like this all day. Let's see. You want to do different things, but you still want to play together. <laughs> you need to compromise. That means you find something that's a little bit of what you both want. So a little bit of skating for me, and for me some follow the leader. I see. Hmm. Hmm. What if we play follow the leader on roller skates? Let's do it. Let's play. I love it too. Let's start right away. Yippee! Game sounds fun. We should play too. I bet I'll follow them faster than you. <laughs> Abby saves the show. We came right away. Where's the fuzzly trouble? The most important rose arranging contest of the year is happening here today. But I can't enter without any roses. Without any roses for Rosa Palooza, you say? Oh, we have roses. There's one right here. Beautiful. Snow. <laughs> oh. Abby, glitter goo. Oh, I'm sure it's nothing to worry about, Judge Thorne. Uh, why don't you come in for some tea? <sighs> A cup of tea would be nice, as would a napkin. Thank you. Psst. Let me know if you find the roses. Okay, Bosley. We know there's a Fuzzly around here somewhere. Oh. But where? Ah. Huh? Oh! Look! A glitter glue trail! Let's follow it! Me, Princess Flug, me! Hello, Princess Flug. So, you took all those roses to help the hotel win the Rosa Palooza contest? Yes! Us win! Us! That's spectacular. But you still shouldn't have taken things without asking. Me sorry, me. Let the Rosa Palooza commence! <gasps> Contest starting, Abby. <laughs> oh, no! Wait! <laughs> da -da 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 -da. Judge Thorne, this is our hotel's entry. Everyone helped. <gasps> Why, that's beautiful. By the flower power vested in me, I declare this hotel the winner of the Rosa Palooza contest. The surprise birthday party. Surprise! Happy birthday, Melvin! No party me? It's Melvin's birthday party, Princess Flug. But you're invited too. Thanks, everybody. Have you seen your cake? Look at all the animals. No, no, you flower cake, you. Flowers are okay, but I like the cheetah cake. Cake is for after the pinata. Who wants to play? Pinata. <laughs> <laughs> Me turn jungle cake into flower cake. <gasps> what happened? Where are the animals? I don't understand what happened, Abby. I can fix this, Mrs. Melvin. I just had to talk to Princess Flug. Princess Flug, we know you're in there. You didn't mean to make Melvin's party a mess, did you? Me, accident me. Don't be sad. Come on, we can make this better. Princess Flug has something to tell you, Melvin. Go ahead. Me, sorry, me. It's okay. It was a really cool party. You love parties, right? Me parties me. And you want Melvin to have a great party, right? Melvin, great party. Melvin. So what if you turn this into the best Melvin birthday party ever? Me throw party me? Would you really do that, Princess Flug? Me? Yes, me! Friend. <laughs> Aww. <gasps> Aww. <laughs>
Look, tea party, Flugtilda. Tea party. First, Mimi, big entrance. Huh? <laughs> Everyone sing with me. Flugtilda, me. Yeah! Us conga, us sing. Us conga, us sing. Me, 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 me. Me, no friends, me. She left a note. Everyone loves Flotilda. Me leave forever, me? <gasps> this is terrible. The Fuzzly Spotter. <gasps> Princess Flug's in trouble. To the park. <clears throat> Princess Flug. Hang on. I'm coming. Bomber Blimp's jacket activate. It up. And now if either of us moves, the whole thing will fall apart. Oh, knick-knack shelf not stick together, knick-knack shelf. You're right, but you can make it stick with your glitter glue. Me glitter glue me. On three, you move out and Princess Flood glues. One, two, three. Good job, Princess Flug. Yay, you saved the day! Thanks for helping, Princess Flug. You're the best. Princess Flug's adventure! <sighs> Laundry for the 
Hatcher Palace Hotel. Check. I found something! Ta-da! Ooh! <laughs> Fun! <laughs> the Fuzzly Spotter! Princess <laughs> Flug's in trouble! Zoom review specs, activate! Princess Flug is in the laundry truck! Fuzzly trouble can't delay! To the rescue, save the day! Flowers and bubbles. Beautiful flower. <laughs> Flowers gone. We're home. Look, Abby. Flowers from the flower shop. Princess Flug stopped here. But why? Hmm. Abby, look! Another flower. Rain spark! If we want to get her home, we need a trail of flowers. Huh? Flowers. We see lots of flowers. <laughs> Do you see her yet? No. Just see walking flowers. <gasps> Abby! Yay! We missed you so much. Princess Flood's new pet. Curly Clean Lettuce. <laughs> Sparkles me. Ooh, berries. You eat berries, you. You know like berry, you. You eat banana, you? <gasps> hmm, we need different snacks, me. <laughs> Thank you, Curly. Clean more salad.
chipmunk. These berries are for you. Come and get them. Please don't be scared. We want to be friends and share. There's enough for all of us if we share. And you won't have to take berry bushes anymore. What do you say? Do you think Chipmunk gets it? Me not sure, me. <laughs> chipmunk to berries! Chipmunk! Little Chipmunk? <gasps> gotcha! <laughs> Bedtime routine. Ugh, me getting sleepy, me. Then we'll start right away. First, you can sleep in my bed. Ooh. And finally, the cushiony, soft, extra thick royal polka dot blankie. Blankie is so soft and cushy, perfect for all sleepers. And its big brown polka dots look like squeaky peepers. <laughs> You're right. The polka dots do look like squeaky peepers. Right this way, your highness. This blanket's so cozy and we're sleepy heads. We can stay awake, so we'll curl into bed. There. The perfect bed for a perfect night's sleep. Ah, bed's so nice, bed. Me sleep me. Bed feels lumpy, bed. Uh, so lumpy! Wait a minute. These polka dots look a lot like the peepers. I wonder. Zoom or view specs? Activate! <laughs> All the lumps in Princess Flug's bed were the peepers hiding in the polka dots. <laughs> The peepers were sleepy, and they like sleeping on your royal blanket. Oh, me understand me, but me need blankie to sleep me. <sighs> it's okay, peepers. You don't need to use Princess Flug's blankie. I'll make you your own. Eight little blankies for eight little peepers. Night, night. <sighs> night, night. Princess Flug's Ski Adventure! Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> me looks so bright and shiny in ski suit. Me loves ski trips, me. Me too. And now we can head up that tow rope and ski down the hill. Come on! Yes! Yay! Yay. Up tow rope and ski down hill? Yeah. Yeah. Me never done that before, me. Fuzzlies. And that's why the bulbs aren't here in the dirt anymore. 
We discovered a brand new kind of monster buddy. It's a flower fuzzly. <gasps> An accordion. Super Ooh. sweet. <laughs> Whoa. New fuzzlies? Cool. They're flower fuzzlies. Rose, sweet pea, tulip, daisy. This is Otis, Melvin, and Elvin. Hi, flower fuzzlies. Otis was just playing some music for me and my kitten. Elvin loves accordion music. We love it, too. Can I please try your accordion? Sure. Thanks. <laughs> Lady night. Don't forget to subscribe. Melvin's Lemonade Stand. Get your lemonade. Fantastic! Yeah. Right. Mm. What? That's it? I only had one lemon. That's all I could make. Still thirsty for more. What do we do, Abby? <laughs> Too bad we can't drink these leftover lemon seeds. I know! We'll use those lemon seeds and plant our own tree. Then we'll have all the lemons we need. I'll show you. Come on! Yeah! yeah! Flower fuzzlies make plants grow. That means if the blossom band plays, the lemon tree will grow. So it's music time! <gasps> Awesome band. You're welcome, Abby. See you later. This is so cool. Now I can make lots of lemonade. See, it's our giant lemon juicer. All we have to do is put a lemon on top, then juice it up. Ready, Teeny Terry? Ready. Here you go. Lemonade for everyone. <laughs> Don't forget to subscribe. The Hatcher Palace Playground. Building a playground will be hard work, but if we all work together, I know we can do it. Me brought stuff to build a playground where everyone can make pretty things, me. Really? Because I brought stuff to build a playground where everyone can run around and climb. My idea better. I think my idea is better. <laughs> Ta-da! Sparkle Goose Splash Pool, perfect place to make pretty things. Done. This jungle gym is the perfect place to run around and climb. I'm gonna try it out. Awesome! Yeah! Careful, Bosley. We don't want Sparkle Goo. Bubbles. Oops. Spring shoes activate. Huh? Abby? Bosley? Are you okay? We're okay. The sparkle goo in Jungle Gym bars made a tower fort. Walls in here so shiny and sparkly. It's your fault, this. You should have built what I wanted. 
places to make pretty things. Why couldn't you build what I wanted? Places to run around and climb. Now Abby and Bosley are trapped. Not trapped anymore! Yay! You have to come see this place. It's fantastic. Come on! Yeah! yeah! Pretty! So pretty! And look at all the places to climb around! Don't forget to subscribe. The Blossom Band Town Tour. Okay, Bosley and I set up tour stops for Abby and the Blossom Band. Oh. Now let's hit the road. Yeah, let's yeah. go. Good afternoon, cafe. Are you ready to rock? Yeah. Yeah. Run away, me! Open the rock and roll stage. Next time, Abby just opens stage away from other things. You're right. I'll do a better job next time, and we'll be ready for the big show. Onward! Yeah! <laughs> it's going great! And now the big, big finish! <laughs> Hit the fan, Bosley! All the way up! Yeah! <laughs> Too much! <coughs> oh, too many pedals! Turn it off! Why'd they all run off? It's my fault. I made it too big and blasted the audience with pedals until they ran away. It's okay. Big show tonight will be better. What if it's not? The big concert is canceled. <gasps> Look! It's Abby and the Blossom Band. Why is everyone clapping? We can't wait for your next show. When is it? But I messed up every show. Maybe, but never messed up the same thing twice. I learned from my mistakes. Everyone, the next Blossom Band concert is tonight, right outside in the courtyard. Yeah! <laughs> Don't forget to subscribe. The Blossom Band's runaway stage. This is going to be spectacular. The Blossom Band can perform at Petal Palooza and show everyone they're the most unique flowers ever. <laughs> the Fuzzly Spotter? It says the Blossom Band is traveling away from us. We've got to catch them and get them to the park before they miss Petal Palooza. Rock and roll stage up ahead! Rock and roll stage going away! Not if I can help it. Eject your seat, activate. Roller skate boots, activate. Pretty far away. That's why this is a job for the Super Sky Wings. Hey, Blossom Band, everybody okay? All good. Um, now, the award for the most unique flower. We're too late. Grab your instruments and let's do this. Always follow your dreams. The trophy is yours! Congratulations! Yay! Don't forget to subscribe! Blossom Band versus the Rockin' Roses! Is everybody ready for a country song? Yeah! Huh? Where's that music coming from? Let's 
check it out! Yeah. Yeah. Who stole our audience? I'll check it out. Come on, Bosley. Thanks for coming, everyone. We're the Rockin' Roses. Yeah. Yeah. She started home being. Oh, the crowd loves Rose's pedal power pop. Then they'll really love this. It's the biggest pedal popper ever. Oh, 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 oh. Everybody, one. Abby, now you can come back and sing for the Blossom Band. She can't because she's singing with the Rockin' Roses. Blossom Band. Rockin' Roses. I'm not singing for either one of you. <gasps> hmm. But it's Tulip's fault. She wouldn't play my rock song. It's Rose's fault. She wouldn't play my country song. Dear friends, even if you disagree, you can compromise. Work it out so you each get a little of what you want. Yeah! If Abby likes honey and Bosley likes apples... Um, yummy for both our tummies! Think we can compromise so you can come back to the band? I'd love it. <gasps> the Blossom Band presents the perfect mix of everything they love. The Rockin' Country Show! <laughs> Abby and Bosley babysit. For bed. No sleep. Hey! That's it! A game! It's the perfect way to get you peepers tired. We'll play hide and seek. No more singing, okay? You hide, Bosley, and I'll count. Okay. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ready or not, here we come. Found you! Aha! Uh huh? Great hiding, Peepers! Now come out, come out, wherever you are! Where are Peepers, Abby? I'm not sure. I'll track them with my watch. Hello! Spotted! They're in the fuzzly passageways! We've got to get them before they mess up Mom and Dad's party! Come on! We're not Peepers, it's bedtime. Ah, Peepers fast asleep. Sweet dreams, Abby. Hmm. Princess Flug's lumpy blanket. Time for your royal bedtime routine. <sighs> me getting sleepy, me. Then we'll start right away. First, you can sleep in my bed. Ooh. And finally, the cushiony, soft, extra thick royal polka dot blankie. Blankie is so soft and cushy, perfect for all sleepers. And its big brown polka dots look like squeaky peepers. <laughs> You're right. The polka dots do look like squeaky peepers. Right this way, Your Highness. This blanket's so cozy and we're sleepy heads. We can stay awake, so we'll curl into bed. <laughs> There, the perfect bed for a perfect night's sleep. Ah, that's so nice, bed. Me sleep me. That feels lumpy, bed. Ugh, so lumpy. Wait a minute. These polka dots look a lot like the peepers. I wonder. Zoom review specs activate. <laughs> All the lumps in Princess Flug's bed were the peepers hiding in the polka dots. 
got it. It's Otis. He's in the fuzzly passageways. <laughs> Zoom review specs activate. I see his tentacle prints, but they end right here. Strange. Peeper deliveries. 
tubes go to every place in the hotel. Now we can deliver anything anywhere. And we've got all kinds of stuff to deliver. <laughs> we've got customers for the bigger and better peeper transport system. Come on, peepers.
She doesn't want to get dirty, so she'll watch from her royal viewing box. Ta -da 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 -da! A royal gold cushion! <gasps> and royal red carpet! find a track and field sport I can do without my fuzzly catching gear. Curly try long jump. Good idea. Here's the start line. <whistles> Curly jump long, long, long. Yeah. 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 Curly. Yeah. Okay, my turn. No gear, just jump. Here I go. Pogo spring shoes activate. <gasps> oh, I knew I'd do that. This jump doesn't count. I'm too nervous to long jump without using my pogo spring shoes. Don't give up. Try another track and field sport. How about shot put? Throw a ball really far. Go! Be confident, Abby. You can do it. I can't do it. Launch your glove, activate. Ta-da! I have another pie. Oh. Oh. Sorry about your picnic. It's okay. We kind of lost our appetite. Come on, Jeffrey. Let's go fly our giant kite. Yes! It's no use. I can't do track and field day at all. What do we do? Oh, no. Bosley, look out! We lost control of our kite! Ah! <gasps> Abby! Help! Abby! I'm coming! Yeah! Track and field sport? Jumping over things is called hurdles. I just did that without any of my gear. Great sport! Hurdles are my track and field sport. I'm good at them all by myself. And all of you help me figure it out. Yay! Friendship day! Happy Hearts and Hugs Day, everyone! <sighs> Check out what I got for later. A Hearts and Hugs Day Disco Ball! Whoa! Okay, who wants to share Hearts and Hugs Day wishes first? Hearts and Hugs Day is finally here, so we'll hold our loved ones near. Whoa! It's a special day! Song, you tried singing like the peepers. Happy Hearts and Big Hugs Day! <laughs> All your ideas have come from other fuzzlies. But Hearts and Hugs Day is about what's in your heart. My heart? Yeah. What is in your heart? Hmm. Elevator? Buttons? Friends? And love! Ding, ding! Otis has idea! Come right behind you to the elevator! Here we go! Sticky. Really sticky. 
should do? <laughs> I'm glad you're all okay. I guess I'll get back to my pancakes now. And I'll let you, Fuzzlies, get back to whatever birthday surprise you were planning. <laughs> what happened? How'd you get stuck? Our presence for Abby led to trouble. Hmm. Oh, Fuzzly, no. It's a combination of our ideas. Rocket-powered tap boots and a musical light show cooling hat. Fuzz-tastic. Dancing and flying made me hot. Ah. This is the best birthday present ever. Thank you so much. The Fuzzly's Fancy Dance Party. Watch your feet, you can walk. Yes. <laughs> Why are we dancing? Your father and I were invited to a ball. A ball? A fancy dance with music and beautiful <laughs> gowns. Fancy. When are you going? Actually, we're not. Why not? The ball's tonight, and the hotel's too busy. I have the best idea. Since Mom and Dad can't go to the ball, let's make them a ball right here in the hotel. Good idea! Ball's so fun for everyone. Isn't 
good. are scary. He ate one of our cookies. He ate a cookie? He is a monster. Flying We'll make a trail of cookies for the monster to follow. More cookies? Ooh, I could use some milk. Okay, now's our chance. Hi there, monster. Wait. I've heard that noise before. Hmm. <gasps> it's my dad. Hi, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> we thought you were a monster. <laughs> I look pretty monstrous. Go back to your slumber party and I'll get cleaned up. <laughs> Melvin stays over. Okay, everybody. <laughs> Bouncing race across the park. You go, you! Surprise! You made me my very own 
snug? Sure did. You happy? You, happy? You. Yeah. Uh -huh. you Fuzzlies are the best friends ever. <laughs> Thanks, Grumbles. <sighs> Wait, don't go. I know I couldn't sleep in any of your snugs, but I'd love a sleepover in mine. Will you stay? Yeah! yeah! <laughs> Good night, Fuzzlies. Good night, Abby. Abby's Care Case Dilemma. Introducing the Ultra Super Fuzzly Case. Wow! And it's connected to your watch, so it can hear when Fuzzlies call for help. I'll let the Fuzzlies know it's your day off. going to show you the most fuzztastic hotel you've ever seen. Hmm. Our elevator operator, Otis, makes getting around the hotel truly magical. Watch it. Smoothie? This is all fun. 
fine, but truly, we've seen enough. No, you haven't. Don't give up on us. There's so much more to see. <laughs> There's a big snowstorm blowing in. We had to cancel the Christmas party. Cancel? <sighs> if our friends can't come to the hotel Christmas party, then we'll bring the hotel Christmas party to them. Yeah! We may not have Santa's sleigh and flying reindeer, but we've got a grumble sleigh and flying fuzzlies. Yeah! 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 Hmm. Need one more thing. Yes! You are so ho-ho prepared. Light it up. Mo and Bo have Christmas glow. Then away we go. Copter ears go. On Bosley, on Peepers, on Mo, on Bo. We delivered our Christmas traditions, and we can get home in time for Santa. Yay! Yay! Hurry, everybody! It's Christmas morning! Come on! Yay! Yay! Hey, Santa came! Yay! Wow! Oh my gosh, Look I love I got. this! Cool! Ding, ding, ding! Love presents me! Cool! Merry Christmas, Abby. We love you. I love you, too. I love all of you. And I love celebrating Christmas together. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, Abby. Chinese New Year. Happy Chinese New Year. Uh-oh. <laughs> you made meatballs. Waipo loves your meatballs. Meatballs for Grandma. It'd be so great if she could spend Chinese New Year with us. Why, Po is joining us for Chinese New Year. She's on a plane and she'll be here by sundown. Huh? What? <gasps> that is spectacular! You know what this means, Bosley? Um, uh, big hugs from Grandma? Yes. And it means we get to make the perfect Chinese New Year celebration for her. Come on! <gasps> Off we go! <laughs> So sorry. It's not your fault, Grumbles. It was an accident. What we do, Abby? I don't know. Without a dragon dance, it wouldn't even feel like a Chinese New Year celebration. Abby! Fuzzies! <gasps> oh, this room is beautiful. Oh, dear. Was that a dragon costume? It was, but we messed up and wrecked it. I'm sorry we can't give you the perfect Chinese New Year celebration, Waipo. If you want a dragon dance, I bet you can figure out how to do one. Can you help? Of course! Yeah! Yeah! Ooh, I can't wait! Me neither. Welcome, welcome to my po. We love you so much, you know. Thanks for giving us the chance to Chinese New Year's dragon dance. Amazing, Abby! This is the most incredible Chinese New Year ever! Thank you, Ipo. Abby! 
Abby and Marley babysit.
when they spilled.
her to your room. Have you seen her? No, but come and see my new pink hamster. Huh? Pink hamster? She's not a hamster, Melvin. She's little doe. Let's get you back to the others. <gasps> Keep her past. 